morning, everybody. I'm Diane Ryan. Lots of people need a fingerprint to get a job here in Arizona in all different occupations. And there's a new way to get that fingerprint, and it's a lot easier than using the ink. We're going to explain it to you coming up. Many employers now are requiring drug tests, background checks, fingerprints before they'll hire you. Yeah. And so there's a, you know, fingerprinting the old way where you put your finger on ink right. and you put yes. it on paper yes. and then it's messy for one thing and then you got to send it out and then the FBI has to check it out and, and to get your prints in the system. Takes a and while. And by the time the results come back, maybe the job is closed right. or they hired somebody else. Right, right. So in the job shop, Diane Ryan shows us a new inkless fingerprinting service that may help you get into a new job a little bit faster, Diane. Hey, that's right. I was surprised that so many people who are looking for jobs really do need fingerprints. And we're talking about people who are teachers, people in law enforcement, nurses, even volunteers who are working with the elderly um, or disabled or young people. They need to have they need to have these fingerprints and a lot of people have been doing them the old-fashioned way just as Rick was talking about this is the ink pad and you put your finger here and then you put it right there and there's your print but sometimes it gets smudged and that's a problem and if it does you may lose the job because you have a short window of getting that job with me this morning is a uh, Holly Nellis she is one of the people coming to get the new way of doing it and it's called Arizona live scan and tell me why you're why you need one well in the state of Arizona the the Department of Education now requires all volunteers to have a department or a fingerprint clearance card from DPS so you can go on the campus and work with kids and that's everybody has to do that anybody who works around uh, anybody a school who steps on campus yes okay so have. you're coming here to try something new yes all right come on over here and, and we're with the owner right here her name is um, Paula Wilson and Paula tell me a little bit about this you're using uh, scanners pretty much yes we are we're using live scan technology to um, take the fingerprint images and it's 99.9 percent .9 acceptance rate so that um that really is an improvement over the ink pad and uh, we just want everybody to know that this is all accepted by the Department of Public Safety and all the different regulatory agencies in the state. Show us how it works because we don't use ink on this one. Okay absolutely. Holly come on and step up. We'll need to start with your left hand, your four fingers, a little bit of an angle and on the glass. So what are, what are we putting her hand on here? This is a glass and it's like a glass platen and it has the technology behind it where it's capturing the images and also providing us with the uh, on-site uh, verification. It allows us to rescan if we didn't get a good image the first time as well. So it lets you know right away rather than like the ink where you don't know until later. Exactly. So we're, we're going to make sure that these fingerprints are not rejected and they're absolutely acceptable and classifiable. Right. And, and this is something that you said a lot of people need uh, and a lot of people have mistakes in these and you said there's really no government uh, regulation or oversight on this. Well. Um, for in terms of uh, training, the FBI is going to set the standard for all of the fingerprints. Um, however, in the state of Arizona, we are all operating on our own in terms of fingerprint collectors. Um, and so, our here at Arizona Live Scan, we wanted to invest in these systems because we know it's the the industry's best technology. And uh, how much does it cost for the systems or for the fingerprint? No, for somebody to come and have theirs? It's 19.99. 19.99. Okay, and you you pretty much guarantee it's going to be good. 99.9 percent. .9%. Okay, great. Well, thank you very much. So she's been in the business for a while, and she decided to try this as something that pretty much is almost foolproof. Okay. All right, go Good get your know. fingerprints done, yes. Diane. <laughs> <laughs> Beth is up next with the tip of the day.